Okay, we've got another teammate. Ashley. I know where it is, Ashley. There's always the Scorpion One armor in here. Um, which is quite nice, actually. Need to level up Ashley first. She has four points to put in. Um, assault rifles. Uh, putting them into assault training is always nice. Because um, fitness is good. You get immunity from fitness. And that's, that's a pretty useful skill. Um, oh, I'll give her a combat armor. Is that... Oh, shield boost. Shield boost is nice. Oh, we'll go with that for now. More? Alright, oh, yes, I leveled up, didn't I? Level 2. I'm going to put one into charm every other level. To a certain point. To about here. Sniper rifles. Don't really need that just now. Vanguard. I haven't used any biotics yet. Put one into there. Um, where's shield boost? Ah, tactical armor. We don't want to unlock tactical armor. I'll put one in there and one in there. Caden lift is quite a f long way away. I'll put one into throw and one into barrier. He has electronics as well, which is quite good. Especially considering I don't have it. Because I'm not an infiltrator. Where is... I have warp and throw. Exciting. actually use it. Oh, hey! All targets down. And I leveled up again. How exciting. Okay, I'll just work towards that more put one into charm um... and I guess I'll just put one into sniper rifles I'm gonna want sniper rifles at some point I find it very useful to have a sniper rifle at certain points of the game. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the Geth? Hard to say. Maybe we'll know more after we check out the research camp. You think anyone got out of here alive? If they were lucky. Maybe hiding up in the camp. It's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Change of plans, Shepard. There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. Sometimes get a sniper rifle in here. The, uh... The loot is um, pretty random most of the time. Sometimes it's standard, but a lot of the time it's just random look what, what you get. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place for an ambush. Keep your guard up. Caden goes and jinxes it. Oh god, they're still alive! What did the Geth do to them? It's 
not dead yet. Nice. Sometimes I don't manage to kill them before they get to me. Somehow. I don't know why. Maybe it's times that I've been trying out different weapons and I've been using assault rifles or something. Assault rifles are very inaccurate. Especially at the start of the game. Because as you upgrade your skills in certain weapons, your, your aim gets more steady. I mean, pistols is really steady straight at the start. Well, it is for me anyway. If you go into sniper rifles, that's me holding it still, you see. But as you put more points into it, that door. it gets more steady. I'm going to be putting unlocking shotguns and putting more points into there and using shotguns for once as well. I'll probably be using pistols a lot though, because pistols are just good. I I find them very useful to use. Ah, decryption. Thankfully, an easy decryption. It can be a pain sometimes. Humans, thank the maker. Hurry, close the door before they come back. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you, I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to save us. No one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. Soon, only ruin and corpses will remain. What else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment, the next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. We could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to move, until you came along. Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him, the Prophet leader of the enemy. He was here before the attack. That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances, who knows what secrets are locked inside. We have unearthed the heart of evil, awakened the beast, unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please, this isn't the time. What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. Let's move. Saren. Nihilus. Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. 
Ooh, he bad. And he come around here. And it's epic. In the distance. It's a ship. Look at the size of it. Whoa, I did not see him. Okay. Haha. <laughs> I keep going to the bodies expecting there to be loot and I haven't played this game for a while. Too much Skyrim, too much other games where you loot bodies. Easy decryption. More decryption. Oh, not so easy decryption. Everybody stay calm out there. We're coming out, we're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? You're okay now. Nobody's gonna hurt you. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Ah, uh, I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. I knew it was trouble the second I saw it, so we made a break for the sheds. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that! We survived! If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance! Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only, it was coming from inside your own head. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, Felt like it was tearing right through my skull. Almost made it impossible to think. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you gotta learn when to shut up. You have something to tell me, Cole? Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. You're breaking the law, Cole. We're not hurting anybody. Hell, most of the time I don't even know what's in the packages. Just thought there might be something we could use. I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure there's nothing else in here that could help us out? Yeah, there's one more thing. I was gonna sell it after this was over, but you probably deserve it more than I do. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. He might have something to do with this whole attack, Cole. We need his name. It's important. Yeah, okay, you're right. His name's Powell. Works the docks at the spaceport, if he's still alive. I have to go. Good luck. And we have a pistol. I, I don't know how this guy could have anything to do with the attack, but, uh, well, he fell for it. Striker 2. Well, that's nice and good. Combat sensor. Some enemies use jamming technology to block your weapon radar. That's the radar that's the circle down the corner that shows up enemies as red dots. Geth use jamming technology. Well, I'll equip it. Because I don't have anything else. Armor piercing rounds. Anti personnel rounds. 
Synthetics. Geth are synthetics, so that's useful right now. Um, I guess I'll give Caden something. I'll give him the striker. Nothing else there. Uh, I'll give him the phasic rounds. Let's go see what happened to Nihilus. Nihilus. Uh, 